weekend was spent drawing, 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 and cleaning, cleaning, cleaning. I've got, whoa, I've got to mop real quick. Because, believe it or not, I mop probably two or three times a week here. But, uh, you know, there's a lot of comments, which they don't bother me. It's whatever. You guys just sound like somebody's girlfriend. That sound like somebody's girlfriend who wants to get dumped. Um, yeah, I work here, too. It's like a working studio. So it gets really dirty every single day because there's a lot going on. So, but for the record, I do mop all the time. And if I got people like, get a maid, get a maid. I have a maid. I've had maids in the past. But I work here so often that when would the maid would have to literally just follow me around like a shadow. So there's really no point. And I'm always here or at the shop and I'm never like, I'm never not here for long enough. You know what I'm saying, right? All right, cool. Maybe you're just crazy. It's morning and I'm gonna mop and Ern will be here in a minute to help me mess this all right back up and then we'll get the day started. All right. We got a change of Mars grass. This is generally what my apartment looks like beginning of the week. This couch probably needs to get replaced by now because Amar and Doobie have had their way with it. We'll always stay, no matter how I clean my art desk, we'll always, always, always end up at least like this within 10 minutes. Yeah, everything else is just whatever. This random stuff I gotta move. Shroom is, whoa, what's what, what's going on? You pressing me? Shroom's fairly clean. Although, I was convinced that I bought another shelf for that other side over there. Finally, got to clean up this bathroom. So the shower is now no longer being used as storage. All those totes are gone. This is trash. Stuff I need to go through just for a second. And then this is just kind of regular right now. There's kind of stuff, oh, ah, this stuff. There's kind of stuff everywhere in here. So this needs to get cleaned just a little bit more, but yeah. That is how I spent my weekend. What y'all want to see? What you want to see? Gotcha. Alright, these towels clean in episode one. Oh. <laughs> this is a slow and calculated attack. Sit. Good man. Look at that face. He's now like, I don't know, like 35 minutes late, but he's gonna come in here and tell me I said 10.30 to start when we start every single day at 10. What did I forget? What? Why am I brain dead? Why are you brain? Because we start every single day at 10 o'clock. It's been 10.30 every day. It is not! You're here at 10 o'clock every fucking day! Yeah, you're here like 10.15, 10.12, shit like that, but... You tell me 10.30. You I got off live early. stream at 9.15 and said I'm on my way to your house. Which Today? Is, you can watch it if you shared it. You're like, alright, I'm out of here. I'm headed over to Teddy's. That was like 9.15. So let me believe you're on your way. I don't I just care. Tell the fans. I don't care. I'm just <laughs> letting you know that you led me no, to believe I that you were I on the way. I still had to bring Brandy 15 minutes later. Listen, tomorrow. I don't want to get involved in your domestic shit. I'm just saying. Here, yeah. I brought Tropicana. Um, Some dusty ass Tropicana <laughs> sitting in that fucking jar. This is smarter than I wrote. No, no, no. Hey. Hey. He's crazy. Oh, he's hey. Whoa, I got him. Off. Yes. Smoking on that Tropicana, I brought the dried out stash from the closet. A little dusty Tropicana stash. Yeah. I got a box over there. A big box. Oh shit, what is it? Oh, oh. shit, is the cans in here? For reals. Um, you still gotta text me Alex's address. Oh yeah. Kid. Oh, yeah. Why, where am I drinking? Hey, look I don't know why you just grabbed that, honestly. Just don't, I don't, yeah, I don't, I don't know. know hey, hey, hey. Go get your toy. Yo, motherfucker! Oh shit! I oh, know. I got the pink one. Shout out to the homie for not wearing it last year. Yeah. Yeah. Like after I had all of them, like once the season was over, I was like fuck. I really want the pink one, and I tried to get it, and no one had it. Shit. And then the other day, someone, my friend Josh, hit me up and was like, "I got the, I got this pink one for sale, or I have it. I've never worn it, bro. If that's my size. It's like I'm buying." And then he tried to get me to pay extra for it, and I just kept like being cheap. Let's go outside. But first, I thought these both these players were just playing it on. Yeah. yeah it's, uh, it's so two top players should play together. <laughs> it's so 
That is sick. We're, we're, picking, we're picking a tree, too, together. Who is it? Me and you. No, you can go pick a tree. I already thought you were doing Bringing the tree, and I'm bringing lights and ornaments and presents. What are you going to do with the tree when you're done? Throw it out in the woods. Oh. That's what you do. Just toss it. It's biodegradable. It's just a tree. Shit. Damn, somebody in the real is getting loose. But yeah, it's got to so, be me. So me girl. and you. Oh, yeah, me? I live in 1124. Trying to score. <laughs> Woo. Oh, that was a workout. You ain't fooling him. What's that big box? Fuck that little box. Dude, you give me the box inside of the box, motherfucker. I'm holding the fuck box. You know what? I think this is gonna allow him to do something. And fucking. It's amazing every time. Are you trying to get all my clothes organized? Yeah. Uh, starting in here. So this nice. Is my, my bedroom looks. It's good. This is a tough time to review the mattress. It is a tough time. Ooh. Ooh, really the tans. I think this is my favorite pair. Yeah, uh, me too going back on it. Like I said, I wanted the multi-color, but. Yeah. Oh, oh. What, I'm going to eat. I'm going to eat, sir. Hey, stop. Can you stop? What? Back of me, son. <laughs> Little green crack get things popping. Yo, yo. So what's the name of this place? Cuero? Cuero Arepas. Yeah. Cuero Arepas. So I went to this place last year, actually probably like around this time, honestly. I wanted to go there, I don't know. Just decided that's where I wanted to go to lunch before I go back to the drawing board. Back to the drawing board. For the board. evening. Yo, dog. I see him. I gotta get over. Oh my God. It's the old New York way to get out. You just pull out. Hey, it's the fucking illegal hey. way to do shit. I'm in the middle of the road. Hold your horses. Hey. All right. Off I'm we not go. wearing my fucking seatbelt either. Hold on. Hey, now I'm fucking crossing both lanes of traffic. <laughs> I'm going left. I gotta go over to Spear. Hey. I just did a loop. Now here. I went the wrong fucking way anyway. No, I didn't go. This is the only way to turn. I had to go left hey, and left. I'm cutting all that out, so I just look like an asshole when you look like you're wrong. It's <laughs> <laughs> oh. you're getting tatted, huh? Yeah. You ready? Yeah. You prepared? Not really. How many hours are you doing? Seven? Eight? Yeah. Yeah, it's not like you want nine. Yeah. It'd be done by Kodak Black concert. What time does that start? I don't know, probably seven or eight. So, we're actually going to test you for like an hour. No. What? I was thinking three or four. You're fucking crazy. I'm not tattooing you for three or four hours. What are Why, you talking you can't about? Sit there that long. You're not even gonna make it three hours. Even if I fucking was like, sure, three hours, fine. Not happening. Three hour challenge. You've sat challenge. for three hours once in your life. It was on your upper arm. Now I do yoga. Uh, God. You're already scared. It's been a long time. It's been a long time since you got tatted. Oh, and everybody sits so good when I walk around the shop that I gotta come in, I gotta hold it down. This thing has me going kind of loopity. Here we go. Loopity doopity, here loopity I go. Doopity, pro there, Avanti, that's the name of the place. It's inside of there. Avanti. Okay. That's where we're going. Avanti. It's like a fancy place you would take your girl to go shopping. Yeah, or like Yo, that. girl, I just copped you some money. Avanti. I'm gonna go get my hair done in here. Avanti. Avanti. They whisper in their commercials. Hair by Avanti. I feel special. You want to feel different. We don't have a stop sign. He doesn't appreciate you. Cut your hair. Cut your <laughs> fucking hair. Men don't like change. Freak them out. Yeah. <laughs> I cut all my fucking hair off. Whatever. Whoa. You look at this fucking big ass thing. Jesus Christ. Holy shit. <laughs> it's huge.
the counter. I had an exotic location picked out <laughs> for the on feats today, but <sighs> Ernie left the good camera at home. So now we're just gonna go back home and get it and shoot the on feats because I won't have time to come back out here. It was the most exotic, beautiful, pearlescent, emotion evoking. It would have gotten probably an Oscar. Did Oscars, is that for a film? Yeah, I don't know. I never know. Oscars, Academy Awards, Grammys. It would have gotten some kind of fucking Nobel Peace award. Prize. I brought world peace with my own feats. Yeah. It's the start of, that's the first line of my next rap album. Yeah. I brought world peace with my own feats. That would be dope. Earn these motherfucking coffee. On my goddamn counter every single day. I cleaned it up <laughs> the last few days. <laughs> that was good. My food was messy. I don't remember being so goddamn messy. Because that dude was cool. I was like going yeah. over, I was looking at and that. And that and guy the was a dick at the fucking place. He said, like, Well, there's a lot of food in here, but don't worry, man. We're going with you. And then I ordered it and you went, All right, I'm getting pizza. <laughs> You all right? Oh yeah. Are we playing PUBG right now? Like, what the like. fuck is wrong with you? Uh, you set me up. You set me up every day. You can stress me out, put me in these fucking crazy situations, forget shit on purpose, so that you're trying to destroy me. Oh. Yeah. It's a battle. Someone said that you're gonna have your own spin-off YouTube channel because I'm so mean to you. <laughs> <laughs> like we're like Jake Paul and the Martinez twins, and you're gonna fucking be like, Teddy used to. Pr They're like. Oh. You're gonna make videos like a confession. If you write a diss track, if there ever comes a day where you're writing a diss track on me for the internet, I'm just gonna, I don't even know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I'm never gonna write a diss track. It'd be amazing. Yo, yo, Teddy. Get it yourself. That's gonna be called Get It Yourself. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. Yeah, yeah, you want something to eat? Well, drive yourself. That's me pulling up to you and then you're coming for the car and I'm yeah. pulling away with yeah, yeah. Get it yourself. Like, <laughs> oh, you need blunts? Well, get them yourself. Oh, you want fun? Well, get it yourself. Yeah, get it yourself. Yeah, get it yourself. <laughs> My name is Ernie. Yeah, you get it yourself. Just out here trying to make a living. I'll go P-U-B-G as Burger King soda right there and take off. <laughs> you won't. I'll give you $100 if you hop out and grab a soda and drive off with it. <laughs> Uh, I'll idea. take the hundred dollars and bring it back to him. That I was in be... LA one time and there was a bunch of like basically skid row, but yeah. um, there was like this fucking dude was sleeping and this other like tweaker ran up. Next to the sleeping guy was like a bag of Burger King or McDonald's or something. Yeah. And this tweaker like ran up and screamed and grabbed the bag, opened the bag, there's like a burger in there, and he just like opened the wrapping of the burger and then slammed the burger on the ground. And I, <laughs> just like took off running again and I was like, yo, what the fuck? <laughs> the dude just violated my man's lunch. He's gonna wake no up. Reason. He's gonna wake up and just be like, what the fuck? You know, like I had probably an extra burger. I was like, alright, I'm gonna take a nap. I'm gonna wake up, eat this burger, bang some fucking heroin, go back to sleep. <laughs> nope. Wake up. Burger's fucking done. <laughs> Smashed looks on like, the ground. Looks like thing. it's been looted. Yeah. <laughs> and your fucking friend's mad at you. Wake up. You're like, what the fuck? Larry, I told you no fucking cheese. I hate cheese. Oh my god, that's exactly what it is. My mom liked cheese. Jesus, fuck. <laughs> I'm gonna make it even worse now. So, uh, we'll get this battery back. See you tomorrow for the tattoo. Yep. And then Wednesday, we got haircuts. And that's all I know. Okay. Maybe Thursday snowboard. Oh yeah, say so you said something about that. It might be an idea, yeah. I'll... Ah! Oh my god. Woo! Woo! Remember earlier I said something about Ernie's coffee cup? Here it is. Just so we're clear, I'm not making shit up. I also don't really care. But that is pretty much the day. So uh, we've got, let's see, we had a drop on Sunday. AI drop, t-shirts dropped. Most of it sold out. There's still some sizes left, but there's probably still something if you missed out or forgot or didn't know about it or whatever. Stuff left, osteddy.com. More stuff coming, getting ready for another drop and mystery bag and New York sneaker con. That's all coming up pretty quickly right before Christmas. And then yeah, that's pretty much it. So like I said last week, most of my time will be spent drawing the next couple of days. Well, really like the next, like basically until I go to New York, I'm drawing. So um, 
yeah, there's that. I'm getting back in a tattoo shop at least one day a week. So I've got a lot of planning stuff to do with just, you know, like organizing everything. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So Omar's still napping away. He's got the hardest life out of all of us. And then we got shoes today. I'm going to talk to you guys about um, a pair of Pharrell's that we got. The uh, tan or sun colorway, as I hear it called, Pharrell. This is the box. We've reviewed, I don't know how many of the new Pharrell's we reviewed. At least one pair. Have I been slacking? Get to all of them eventually. I just uh, cop so many shoes that uh, I literally can't get to them all. So looking forward to a slower December, hopefully, as far as shoe drops go. I know there's a few things coming that I'm absolutely going to cop. Yeah, not as much. So, uh... At least not as much as last month. But this Pharrell, which we'll just call the sun colorway for now. Walk on the left shoe, breathe on the right shoe. So we've uh, covered, I'm gonna go with breathe. We've covered quite a few shoes. And the one thing I'll touch on first and foremost is with the black shoe, this one here, the knitting is completely different. Straight up, I had said they had fixed the human race kind of sizing and it's not really true necessarily. The black one fits more like a reigning champ upper and these uppers, this upper and the green upper are exactly like the old. Uh, human races so literally the exact same but yeah so sizing wise you could probably still half down I half down on my BBC ones so that's two Pharrell's we reviewed I half down on those and they're fine so whatever you want just remember there's no insole so don't play yourself so this colorway is one of my favorites out of the pack I, I everyone's always everyone just like what's your favorite what's your favorite um the black one's probably the most wearable to most people I really like this colorway a lot. A lot of people don't like it for whatever reason. The colorway itself just reminds me, um, I can't like put my finger on it, but it's just very like childlike to me. The orange colorway reminds me of almost like the inserts that toys would come in and you would like pop things off the way those colors look. I just like that vibrancy about it. It's very like art deco vibrant. The earth tone in it, it's just a nice contrast with this one. It's just, just a good colorway. Nice use of color. Blue, orange, tan, yellow, I mean, Dog, it's a color dream. Trail sole has improved, I would say, the fit and overall just comfort of the shoe. I said before, I feel like it gives you something to bounce back on. Uh, a lot of people have been complaining about the weight with the Trail Boost. The weight doesn't bother me one bit. I don't really notice it. Like, I don't notice that my shoes are real heavy like that, um, as long as they're not stuffy, if that makes sense. Purple laces as well. Breathe and walk on these are embroidered. See the embroidered stitching? There's a little snag right there, like right away. Major one major difference on this one that I like is a nice little, nice little hit. Uh, the trefoil is all well, the trefoil is green, but the back, the back heel tab is 3M reflective on this pair. I think it's the only pair, it's the only pair I've noticed 3M on the back heel tab. So that's cool. Adidas on one side, the Pharrell Williams equal sign on the other. And then, uh, so resell on these, it's interesting. It's about where it was last time with Pharrell's right after they dropped. You could get pairs for around 450, 500 bucks, which is about double. And then, um, and then they all of a sudden skyrocketed, which is what happens once stock is run through. Um, I don't know how many pairs of each of these were made. I did note there was a restock the other night, like in the middle of the night. It was crazy. Like I think two different pairs. It may have been all four, but that was wild. I woke up to people screenshotting me, um, confirmations. So I don't know what these will do. I don't think Think there's going to be any restocks in the future there's different models coming i'm really looking forward to some of those new models just like the different languages and the tie-dye kind of like art project shoes like i like it i like the whole diy vibe i wouldn't expect any restocks i wouldn't expect resale to really dramatically go down from this point unless there's restocks but you never know picture it just rising from this point on that's just kind of how it goes but yeah this is the pharrell human race in the tan sun gold colorway i don't people call things whatever they want the official name i believe is pale nude so i can see why people are calling it the sun colorway um yeah here they are that's what they look like tan upper orange cage white boost yellow trail black stitched in lettering blue laces and purple and a little black sock liner there for you and then the 3m hits on the back <sighs> boom and here's what they look like on my feet